Have you ever wondered what would happen if Jupiter became a star? Our curiosity, our thirst for the unknown, has led us to question the very nature of the cosmos, to imagine shifting celestial realities. What if the gas giant we know as Jupiter, the fifth planet from our sun, were to transform into a star? An intriguing thought, isn't it? An experiment in speculation. A journey into the heart of the universe. Today, we explore this fascinating thought experiment. Before we delve into the what-ifs, let's understand Jupiter better. Jupiter, the largest planet in our solar system, is truly a marvel to behold. This giant is over 11 times the diameter of Earth and consists primarily of hydrogen and helium, much like our Sun. Its iconic stripes and swirls are cold, windy clouds of ammonia and water, painting a turbulent atmosphere. Jupiter is often referred to as a gas giant, a term coined due to its massive size and gaseous composition. This colossal planet is lacking a solid surface, you see. Instead, it's comprised of dense, hot gases and some mysterious elements that extend thousands of miles beneath its clouds. And let's not forget the Great Red Spot, a persistent high-pressure region, resulting in an anticyclonic storm larger than Earth and raging for at least 300 years. With this understanding, we can begin to explore the possibilities of a Jupiter star. Stars aren't just shiny objects in the night sky. They have a fascinating formation process. To truly understand stars, we must first delve into their essence. At their core, stars are essentially massive, glowing spheres of hot gas, primarily hydrogen and helium, held together by their own gravity. The formation of a star is a captivating cosmic ballet. It all begins in a nebula, a vast cloud of gas and dust in space. The nebula's particles are drawn together by gravitational force, creating a dense region called a protostar. As the protostar continues to accumulate more matter from its surroundings, it grows denser and hotter. Eventually, the pressure and temperature at its core reach a critical point that triggers nuclear fusion. Nuclear fusion is the heart of a star, the process that gives stars their characteristic brightness. In this process, hydrogen atoms in the star's core collide and fuse together to form helium. This fusion process releases a tremendous amount of energy in the form of light and heat. It's this light that travels millions of miles across the universe and reaches us, making stars visible to our naked eye. However, the fusion process doesn't just stop at helium. As stars age and their hydrogen supply dwindles, they begin fusing heavier elements, creating a diverse array of elements that are the building blocks of everything in the universe. This continuous fusion process keeps the star burning bright and maintains a delicate balance. The energy produced pushes outward, counteracting the inward pull of gravity and preventing the star from collapsing onto itself. But stars can't sustain this balance forever. Once a star exhausts its fuel, it undergoes dramatic changes, leading to its eventual death. Depending on the star's mass, it may end its life as a white dwarf, a neutron star, or in a spectacular supernova explosion. So, if Jupiter were to become a star, it would need to undergo similar processes. It's a fascinating thought experiment that leads us to ponder the complexity and grandeur of the cosmos. Imagine Jupiter transforming into a star. What would it take? First, we need to understand that Jupiter, as massive as it is, is still far from star status. Stars are celestial bodies that generate light and heat from the nuclear fusion occurring in their cores. This fusion process primarily involves hydrogen atoms combining to form helium, releasing an enormous amount of energy in the process. For Jupiter to reach this stellar state, it would need more than just a makeover. It would need a serious mass upgrade. Jupiter would need to accumulate more matter, specifically about a thousand times its current mass. Yes, you heard that right, a thousand times more. It's like asking a house cat to match the weight of a blue whale. This additional mass would increase Jupiter's gravitational pull, compressing the planet's core even further. The pressure and temperature would rise dramatically, and if Jupiter became massive enough, conditions in its core could reach a point where hydrogen fusion becomes possible. But wait, there's more. We're talking about initiating nuclear fusion here, an event that's no small feat. To kickstart this process, Jupiter would need to overcome the Coulomb barrier, a sort of atomic repulsion force. This barrier prevents two positively charged atomic nuclei, like those of hydrogen atoms, from coming together. Overcoming this barrier requires extremely high temperatures and pressures akin to those found in the heart of a star. Sounds simple, right? Just add mass, increase pressure and temperature and have a star. Well, not quite. There's a catch. 
Adding mass to Jupiter is easier said than done. Where would all this extra matter come from? And even if we could somehow feed Jupiter the required mass, the process could trigger cataclysmic events, like a supernova explosion, rather than a stable star formation. However, the transformation isn't as straightforward as it seems. The journey from gas giant to star is filled with cosmic challenges and celestial conundrums. But isn't that what makes the universe so fascinating? The endless possibilities, the mysteries yet to unravel, and the cosmic questions that keep us looking towards the stars? A new star in our solar system would undoubtedly have significant effects. That's right, folks. We're talking consequences. And they're quite monumental. Imagine a cosmic shakeup where Jupiter, the largest planet in our solar system, suddenly ignites into a star. It's a scenario that sparks curiosity and a dash of trepidation. After all, stars are no small things, and their influence is vast. So, what would this mean for our solar system? First, let's consider the orbits of the planets. Currently, our planets are in a delicate balance, each following a specific path around the Sun. If Jupiter were to become a star, it would have its own gravitational pull, and this could cause some serious orbital chaos. Planets closer to Jupiter might be drawn into a new orbit, while those further away could be pushed into more elliptical paths. Even the slightest change could have a domino effect, disrupting the harmonious dance of our planets. Then there's the issue of the asteroid belt. Nestled between Mars and Jupiter, this collection of rocky debris is kept in check by Jupiter's gravity. If Jupiter were to become a star, the increased gravitational pull could send these asteroids hurtling out of control. This could potentially lead to a celestial bombardment on a scale we've never seen before. And don't forget about the potential temperature changes. With a second star in our solar system, Earth could experience a significant increase in temperature. This could drastically affect our climate, leading to a host of environmental issues. Lastly, let's ponder on the overall stability of our solar system. At present, our solar system is a finely tuned machine, with each part working in harmony with the others. The transformation of Jupiter into a star could throw this machine into disarray, leading to a future that's uncertain, to say the least. While this all sounds rather daunting, remember, it's a purely hypothetical scenario. We're not predicting a cosmic catastrophe here, just exploring the potential effects of a truly cosmic event. The creation of a new star would certainly be a cosmic game-changer. While the idea of a Jupiter star is intriguing, it's important to separate fact from fiction. It's a tantalizing thought, isn't it? Jupiter, the colossal gas giant, flickering to life as a second sun in our sky. But alas, reality has a way of grounding our most whimsical musings. The transformation of Jupiter into a star is simply beyond the realm of possibility, given our current understanding of physics and cosmology. Firstly, the process of star formation involves a complex interplay of gravity, temperature, and mass. For a celestial body to become a star, it must possess enough mass to ignite nuclear fusion in its core. Even though Jupiter is the largest planet in our solar system, it falls significantly short of the mass required for starhood. It would need to be around 80 times more massive to even begin the fusion process. Secondly, the sheer logistics of artificially inducing star formation are mind-boggling. Imagine trying to cram dozens of Jupiters together. The energy and resources required for such a colossal task are far beyond humanity's current capabilities. Finally, even if we could somehow overcome these hurdles, the consequences for our solar system would be severe. The gravitational balance that keeps our planets in their orbits would be thrown into chaos, with potentially catastrophic results. So, for now, Jupiter will remain our beloved gas giant. Our journey through this cosmic thought experiment has been quite a ride. We've delved into the nature of Jupiter, a gas giant with an intricate celestial dance of more than 70 moons. We've explored the stars, their birth, life, and death, and the conditions necessary for their formation, which Jupiter, despite its grandeur, doesn't meet. We've imagined the transformation of Jupiter into a star, a scenario that would require an almost unthinkable amount of additional mass. We've pondered the potential consequences of such an event, from the creation of a binary star system, to the drastic changes it could instigate within our own solar system. We've also faced the reality check. The laws of physics, as we understand them, prevent this fascinating scenario. Jupiter becoming a star remains firmly in the realm of imagination. While the universe continues to inspire questions and curiosity, one thing remains certain. It never ceases to amaze us.